Alright guys, welcome back to Son of Scotland 90, bringing you the FIFA 17 shout career mode. This is episode 3, we're on beating in the Bundesliga and now we're heading in to Europe. And it is Europa League, we're in a group of Manchester United, there you can see the group there, we've got Manchester United, Strom God Set, who we're playing today I believe for Sweden, and some team called Arruka. There we are standing, waiting for our big match. Here's the Strom's God Set IF team and if you notice anyone from it, then yeah. A bigger football fan than I am, because I don't know fucking anybody from this team. Um, here's the Schalke team we're going with. Farman and Nets has usually been great for us this season. Back 40. Kagara, Naldo, Howeds, Baba, Goretzka, Geese, Connor Palanca, Mayer, Sydney Sam, and we are finally starting new man Angel Correa up front. He's getting his first start of the season, and let's see if he can repay that 20 million price tag that we paid from anyway early on here it's a great chance and it's fallen to some guy in the middle and he's skied it there should have done a lot better it's Maxim Mayer he out wide to Connor Blanca he's not yet to hit form since moving from Sofia but he's just took it past the man the defender there he's doing well he's cutting inside now he's nice wee sidestep and he's He's been dispossessed, but Geese tries to find Conor Belanca. Lovely bring down on the folly, and Conor Belanca strikes it in. Only five minutes gone. Schalke take the lead. It was a decent run. He got tackled in the end, but Geese there uh, managed to play him through. He brought it down. He connected on the folly, and he's putting it past the keeper, and that's a lovely finish. One of the better goals we've scored this season. Probably, I think it's the only goal we've scored this season. So, yeah, nice to get off the mark. We're celebrating on the sidelines. Would expect to beat this team, but a nice early goal. It's worth celebrating anyway. Goretzka to Conor Blanca to Baba, who tries to turn but can't quite get past the defender. But he's won it back. It's Baba. Baba cuts down the left. Baba shoots. Good save though from the keeper. Applying lots of pressure here. We're playing well. It's Baba into Angle Korea. Has loved it past to Mayer. Mayer trying to find Sydney Sam out wide. Sydney Sam brings it down, but it's a good challenge for the defender. Manages to get across into Goretzka, and he gets the head on it. Sydney Sam's cross finds Goretzka's head. The ball finds the back of the net. It's Schalke's 2 0 up. We double our lead. Sydney Sam there. Ball almost going out. He didn't give up on it. He got the ball in, and Goretzka there putting it past the keeper with a bullet of a header. He ain't saving that, and it is now 2 0 here. Goretzka. On the ball, lovely, out to Caraga. We've got 92% pass and we're playing well here, it's Mayer. Nice wee bit of skill there, but he's not going far. Oh, no, he said he's not going far, he's just skint free men, it's Mayer. On his own, he's tried to go on his own, he's took the shots. It's Conor Blanca, brings it down, he tries to find someone in the box, it is cleared though. And that's going to be it for the first half, pure annihilation there for Schalke, we're all over this team. Could have been more, but it's 2-0, and we'll settle for that. You can see the stats, dominating possession, had loads of shots, apart from their chance early on. This, um, Stormgrets haven't really created much. Goretzka now finds Angle Correa. Tries to find it out way to Carrara, and he's got a chance now to whip it in. He's messing about with it, though. He finally does whip it in as Angle Correa, though he can't get the head on it. It's falling to Geese, who tries to... Keep possession, he's lost it though. And now Stormgretzer could try to counter, but how he's a great centre back play from the big man, strong, physical, composing at the back, standing out like a ton of bricks. And it's Connor Belanca through again. Connor Belanca! He puts it in the near post. Keeper probably should have saved that, but Connor Belanca doesn't give a shit because he's got his second goal of the game, and that's a brace for him. And this is maybe just what we needed here. Could this kick start our season? We've been struggling for goals and all of a sudden three come at once. Connor Belanca here. Yeah, keeper. Looks like it bounces off his face like definitely should be doing better there. But Connor Belanca isn't going to care and I don't care. And he doesn't care. Well, that's supposed to be me, but fuck it, it's not really. 3 nil up though. Things are looking great, but McMoan's now trying to get a goal here. Consolation. It's Togstad. Crosses it into. It's falling onto Moan. It's Junior. Into Storfloat. Oh, and he's hit the bar. Opportunity there for 
the Swedish team to get a goal back, they didn't take it and that was the only shot they had in the second half, end of the match. We come out convincing 3-0 winners and that's a great start in our Europa League cam. Payne then see Geese getting man of the match with a 9.1 but Conor Blanca there playing great. Got two goals with a 9.0 rating. Sydney Sam also had a great game 8.6 and there's the group after that one match day game. Man United also got a win but we got a better win than they did so we're currently ahead on goal difference. Up next in the league we've got Herford Berlin. And um, you see our managers went up to 81 or rating, so we're at 80. That win in the Europa League has moved us one, up 1 to 81. Now we're away to Hever Berlin. Hopefully we can get a win here. And it'll be our first one of the season. Can we carry on that good form? Man to watch. Conor Belanca, two goals in his previous game. He'll be out to do it again. You can see the Hever Berlin starting 11. Got Stalker there. Number 14, we have to watch it for him, a good player, also Kalu there, he's got a lot of pace on the wing, have to be aware of that. And you can see our team, it's Farman, Koki, Naldi, Howie, to Barbara Goretzka, Gies, Mayer, Mbolo and Ramadal Falcao coming back in to start in the league. And Stalker now, he finds Skeber, back to Stalker, Victor Stalker. It's Alagur, he's got the ball, it's Baba though coming in with a great challenge there and he maybe got something on that, probably going to be a corner, but great defending from Baba. Stalker, Victor Stalker, the Swiss man is coming at us, the skeeper back to Stalker, a lovely bit of play there for Stalker, he's went round so many, he's still going Stalker with a lovely shot, he's hit the post. It's been followed up in the rebound, but what a goal that would have been from Stalker. But it doesn't really matter. Herford Berlin take the lead here. Not the start we were looking for. 17 minutes in. It's been all Herford Berlin, really. Can't really get out our own box. It is a goal from Darida, I think, in the number six. Like a Stalker there, twisting and turning his way through our defence. We just couldn't get fucking near him, really. And that's 1 0. But hopefully we can do some Goretzka. Goretzka turning. Turning back, it's Goretzka, now he's going forward, Goretzka on his own, he shoots and it's a good save though from the keeper, Mayer keeps this one in, Mayer to Conor Belanca, Conor Belanca turns, Conor Belanca run into the box, Conor Belanca fires it home, what a goal there, rocket into the top corner, it hits the underside of the, pole, the crossbar even, and it finds its way in, keeper not saving that. Lovely there stuff to Conor Blanca. He'd know where to go. He turned it around. He managed to get past the defender and boom, flick at that. Right off the top of the bar. Keeper is not saving that. And that gets us back in the game here. And hopefully now we can go on and push and try and get the winner. Conor Blanca is on fire though. That is his third goal in two games. Kalu though wins the match. Wins the match. Fucking, he lost the ball. I mean, it's Mbolo. It's to Mayer. Mayer. Mayer still going. Lovely stuff from Mayer. Shot blocked though. And Conor Blank is going to leave that one as the half time goes. And there you see, they started better. We got back into it as the half progressed. Pretty even here as we approach the second half. Geese with the corner. Whipped in. Oh, and it's Howds, I think, there. Maybe should have done better with the header, but he's put it past the post. It's Weezer for Berlin to Dorada. He shoots from distance, and it's a great save for Farman. Farman's been great this season, and that is another good save he's had to pull off. But now with 20 minutes to go, we're going forward with Goretzka. Goretzka plays through Baba and now Baba turning inside, it's Baba going on his own, he finds Falcao, Falcao shoots and Falcao this time hits the bar but it doesn't hit the underside and go in, it's hit the top and went over, Falcao there took a chance on him, 16 million, hoping he can find his glory days but he wasn't quite able to score with that shot but good signs for Falcao who is now coming off along with Mayer bringing on big Young class Huntler and Correa on hopefully try and find the winner here. But it's Berlin now pushing for the winner. It's Platt and Hard. The number 23. Oh, and it's Farman with another great save. How's he done it? I don't fucking know, but Jesus Christ, this man deserves 84 million rating. Never mind an 84. Look at that. Boom. Diving header there. The guy goes, goes clean through him. Turns into a spear, but Farman doesn't appear to be a heart. He's celebrating. Ball comes in. 
It's Abisech. Try to pronounce these names. It's like fucking murder, man. It's it's and it's a shot wide of the post. Their farmer and this time wasn't called upon to make the save, and that could have been the winner for Heifer Blend, but it wasn't. They, in truth, they played better in the second half. Maybe they could have snatched the winner, but they didn't. We've we'll hung on for a draw away from home, which is a pretty decent result. Then you see Connor Belanca was man of the match, 8.7. So that's him going 8.7 and 9.0 in his last two matches. And then you can see now with three games played, three draws, and we're 11th in the table. Not disastrous, but we do need to start winning if we want to try and, you know, challenge for the title, which I don't think we're going to do, but top four could be slipping away for us if we don't start catching up soon. Next up, we've got Cologne in the league. Lucas Podolski's former team, and uh, hopefully we can get a win against them. A weaker team, we are at home, we should be able to do it. But thanks for watching, guys, and if you want to comment below and tell me what you think of the episode, and like, and subscribe, I appreciate it. But until then, guys, peace.